I did was to install it, I didn't do a registry hack. What I did was I deleted appraisers uh, dill um, in the setup. So now I'm wondering if when I go to do a, a fresh start, it's going to tell me that the uh, machine is not compatible. And I'll show you that uh, it is Windows 11 on the machine. system. Uh, let's see, uh, Intel i3, Windows 11 Pro, go into my uh, security, uh, device, see fresh start. Now if you click here it'll just lead you to a website. And then you can read in the website. And there should be a link here. Hmm. Usually they have a link. In this thing. Oh, right here. Give yourself fresh start. Open, open recovery settings. Okay, I'm going to open it. Which is, I can get to this the other way through this side anyway. I'll show you that. Close that out. settings recovery yeah, it's the same page reset this PC choose to keep or remove your personal files then reinstall Windows see what I did was I upgraded from 10 and I had these uh, programs on uh, 10 and then it just went right to 11. Okay, I'm going to reset the PC. Keep my files. Remove everything. Okay, you have to make sure that you uh, <clears throat> make a copy of all your files. What I did was I cloned another hard drive. The same as this one here. Remove all personal files, apps, and settings. That's the one I want. Okay, would you like to reinstall Windows? Cloud download local reinstall from this device. Yeah, that's one. Reinstall from this device. Current setting. Remove. Do not. Remove apps and files. Do not clean the drive. Reinstall Windows for this device. Change settings. Clean data. Just remove your files. It's quicker but less secure. Okay, download. No, okay. Confirm. Next. Now, what I'm curious is when they reset this thing, is it going to tell me that this PC is not compatible anymore? Okay, I'm going to reset it. Preparing 1%. The device will automatically restart. Okay, I guess we can. I guess I. No, I can't close that. It's not X. This is going to take a few minutes, so I'll be back. Resetting this PC 1%. 84% now. It's like a fresh install. Okay, United States. No, maybe I'll go back. Uh. Okay, I'm going to go back. Can I go back any further?
Put a lens. Oh. Checking for updates. Call it Dell. And I'm not going to sign in to their Microsoft account. Is that what's going to happen? So, personal use, next. Let's add sign in options. On the flying account. Skip for now. Uh, who's going to use this device? Um, Me. <laughs> and I'm going to password it. Location off. Find my device. Ink off. checking for updates well I'm finally at the start screen Activation state is active. Okay. So it didn't lose the activation. See, I only, there's only two things left on my desktop, which is the recycle bin and Microsoft Edge. And it's now 254 in the corner. Oh, there's a whole bunch of things here. OneDrive, oh, HD. Usually in system protection, they shut that off for some reason. So you have to uh, turn it on. So apply it. And I'm going to create a uh, reset. Re um, and then I'm going to create a restart point. I'm on the health check page. Just keep going and going and going and oh, download the PC health check app. Okay, it's downloading there. Check to see if your PC meets the requirements. Uh, this PC doesn't currently meet Windows 11. This PC must support secure boot, TPM, the processor isn't supported also. Okay. Close that off. I'm going to try a different way to reset it this time. Second attempt. Reset this PC. Remove apps and settings. Remove all. Okay, I'll go that way. It says local reinstall. Reinstall Windows from this device. 
cloud reinstall windows from this device download and reinstall windows this is the one I did before download and re current setting remove apps do not clean the drive download and reinstall windows okay next I'm sure this is going to take a while this one here 100% Let's see what's going to happen now well that took almost an hour out of the box experience again So I guess it's basically the same thing as the first time, but they've had about three gig download, so I'm sure they replaced the Windows files with that three gig. Well, it looks like we're back at the, the start screen again. bunch of things on the bottom here activation yeah still on 